Hello and welcome back to the channel. Thanks for stopping by for yet another video. I do appreciate that and as always I appreciate you. So I come across this here. It says very bright fireball explodes over Arizona. Fourth major fireball within 10 hours. So um, even recently in the last day or two I've been uh, making a lot of videos on these fireballs. So that they definitely the it is definitely picking up as far as fireball activity. And uh, I'm also going to head over to the American Meteor Society here in a little bit to see if I can't find any um, uh, news of more fireballs over there. But well, let's get into these right now real quick. It says, that a very bright fireball streaked through the, uh, the night sky over Arizona on November 15th. Now it says the event lasted up to seven seconds. It does not appear as a good candidate for the Torrid Meteor Shower. It says this is the fourth major, major fireball within 10 hours. It says the American Meteor Society received 108 reports. Um, 12 people reported a sound associated with the event. Four heard concurrent and eight heard delayed sounds. Now, 34 people also reported fragmentation. Now, it says this event was seen over Arizona, California, Nevada, Utah, and New Mexico. So let's take a look at this video here real quick and see what we can see. Oh, yeah, you can see that's that's like another blue fireball, isn't it? That's a really good video here. So we get we've been getting lucky too in catching these fireballs. Um, but if these aren't related to the Torrid Meteor event, then why is the, the activity picking up, right? Isn't that a little bit concerning? If these have nothing to do with that of asteroid event, then why are all, all of a sudden are we getting all these fireballs coming in to our atmosphere? And you can see it definitely looks like it's breaking up as it hits the atmosphere. Um, but yeah, this is a really good video here too. Let's go see what else we have down here. Well, here's another one. I don't know if this is of the same. Let me see. Yes, this is of the same event. So let's take a look at this video. Oh, okay, so this one you're going to have to look really close. See it right down here with my arrows right there? This one isn't as good as a, a video, unfortunately. Um, you could barely see that one in the distance. So this, the one up top there was, oh, this is also another video of the same event. So let's take a look and see if this one shows us some better footage. Yeah, okay, this one is almost coming straight towards you. As you can see this blue arrow right there. You can see how this fireball is kind, of, kind of comes into frame there quickly. Um, this is also of the same event. Let's see what this one shows us. Ooh, did you see how quick that one went past? I think is that what it's is that what it is? I mean, cause I oh was that it? Okay, I'm confused on this one. Oh, it was right there. It must be right there. That bright flash. See it? That's pretty cool. Even though it's just like a second, um, that's still pretty cool. Now look at this. This is a still picture of it, and uh, so that's a, that's a pretty cool photo there too. Now it says the first estimated 3D trajectory doesn't make this fireball a good candidate for the Torrid meteor shower. Um, traveling from northwest to southeast, the visible path of the fireball ended south, south um, somewhere east of Happy Jack, Arizona. So. It says this is the fourth major fireball event within 10 hours. The first event took place on November 14th over western Germany. Now, with, that was with it has 1,150 reports now. Um, it soon became the most reported fireball event from Europe since the American Meteor Society and IMO launched the international version of AMS Fireball Form. Now, it says the second event took place on the 14th and was reported by 42 witnesses. Um, the event was caught by 10 cameras on the French um, network. Now here's another picture of that one as well. Um, it says the third event took place over Ohio in the United States. So far the AMS reported received 38 reports from that one. Um, 13 saw fragmentation. Witnesses did hear some concurrent and delayed sounds. Now this one again I believe is of the same event we were just watching. I'll see it from a different angle there. Look over to your right here, you'll see it. Right there is that.
All right, well, I think that's going to be about it for this video, but I'm going to head over to the American Meteor Society website and see if I can't find any other footage or photos of these uh, events. I've re 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 I have reported, sorry, on some of them already. Um, however, I just want to see if I can find any better footage or photos for you guys. Now, this is the best one um, of these videos here, so I'll show this one to you again. You can see it almost looks like another blue fireball, doesn't it, as it's coming into frame there. And you can see it breaking up. But this one right here is definitely some great footage um, for sure. But um, I do appreciate you guys for watching these videos and supporting the channel. You know, we're growing every day, um, slowly but surely. But, but that's because of you. So I do appreciate you guys very much. But other than that, be sure to share, like, subscribe, and comment down below. Um, I hope you have a great day. Peace.